it feels pretty good. I feel, you know, got a little spring in my step, you know, everybody else too. And it just feels good to be back out there. I like that this team is excited to play in this game. I know kind of the day of the announcement, some people were a little disappointed that you guys didn't get the New Year's Six game. But do you, you think now people are, are kind of building up the energy and excitement to play uh, in the Alamo Bowl? Sure. Ball? Like, you know, people eventually got over and quit pouting about it. And, you know, we're ready to get after it, you know. A bowl's a bowl, you know. <laughs> Just because we're in the bowl season era now, more and more each year, it seems like you're seeing some of the top NCAA players sit out bowl games. I'm just curious what your thoughts are on that trend and that development. Oh, like when they – Just decide not to play in the bowl game for whatever that's, reason to focus on the draft. I mean, I kind of get it, you know, depending on where you're depicted. But at the same time, I think it's pretty selfish, you know, because, you, know, you know, the team gave you an opportunity to play, you know, for them and – you know, he should just finish strong. Has Coach Leach or any of the assistants addressed that with you and this team at all, either this year or in years past since you've been here? No, not really. Was something that you ever thought about doing or consider or kind of thought about Sitting at least weighing ball. your options? Sitting out the ball? Yeah. No. <laughs> um, speaking of this bowl game, you guys haven't won a bowl game since 2015, so that's motivation within itself. How do you guys win this bowl game? How? Yeah. Um, I guess score more points than them, <laughs> but uh, What's it gonna take, I, guess, to I just the mentality that we've you know grown this year, you know us against the world basically. So you know we just got to keep that in our heads and know why we why we play this game. Iowa State's got a good pass rush. They can apply some pressure with just three down linemen, kind of similar to what. UW was able to do. Are you looking at this game almost as a chance for you and the offensive line to, you know, prove yourself in that department and just really put on a good showing there toward the end to finish it off? Yeah, yeah. This, uh, I think this game is a good chance for us five, you know, together to kind of have one last hoorah, you know, before me and Rob leave. So, what was your reaction to being selected to compete in the Senior Bowl alongside Gardner? It was uh, a blessing, you know. I walk in the locker room and I see the invitations sitting on both our lockers next to each other, and it was it was pretty surreal. But we're both really excited to go there. And then, what's it been like for you and Abe both to receive some all conference and then national recognition as well, just to share that with him? It was just, you know, again a blessing. Proud of, you know, myself. Proud of Abe for sure. You know, just done some pretty good things this year. Becoming a tradition that you guys are trying to set offensive linemen was you being named All American. I think you were the fourth straight year that between Joe Dahl and and, uh, and Cody and, and then you becoming All Americans. What, what does that say about what the group's done here? I think you know we've kind of developed a reputation, you know, just for um, you know just getting better, you know. What can you, what can you say about Abe's? Uh, you kind of talked about him. I, I think four weeks in. What can you say about his freshman season and how? How much he improved throughout the year? Oh, tremendously. When he first got here, he was kind of like a, a baby deer. And now he's he looks like he's been here a while, <laughs> you know, for sure. A lot of the times during bowl practices, more of the reps go to the younger guys, just with you being an older player now, not to date you. I mean, is there anything you try and do to help them out throughout that process and get them acclimated, like any pointers or insight you can give to them? Oh, yeah, there's always like little points here and there to, you know, if I notice something, I'll speak up and the other older guys will too, you know, and just trying to get them uh, better and more comfortable, you know, for years to come. Okay, good with Andre? Are you guys taking a look at the uh, the bull gifts that you guys get? You guys? I don't really know okay. about it. Uh, heard there's like an Amazon gift card or something. Yeah. Oh yeah, I don't really, I didn't really pay attention to that, but I'm excited. Okay. Did you talk to, to Cole about the experience of playing in the Senior Bowl last year and kind of what to expect from it and what he got out of it? I actually haven't asked anyone, <laughs> to be honest. I just kind of did some research myself, you know, talked to coaches and stuff, but I actually haven't reached out yet. I plan to, but yeah.